set back in 1934. 82 in Medford for today, also 82 in Tomahawk. We'll have south winds around 5 to 10 miles an hour. Southern part of the area, maybe mid 80s in Adams, 84 in Whiting. So enjoy some nice conditions for today, turning a little more humid this afternoon. And then over the weekend, we'll have to keep an eye on the potential for some thunderstorms. Now, most of Saturday is looking okay, but in the afternoon toward the evening hours, we might have a couple of thunderstorms blowing on through. And then overnight, Saturday night into Sunday morning, potentially a couple of scattered showers or storms. The severe threat doesn't look too high, but this front that's coming in from the northwest will still be over the state on Sunday. So that especially in the southern half of the area on Sunday, we might have some additional storm activity. A level one risk for some storms here Saturday night. They might produce a little bit of strong wind and also a level one risk for Sunday for a couple of storms that could have some strong wind or heavy downpour. So 83 for today, not too hot out there, but certainly warmer than the last couple of days and down to 67 for tonight. So it's, it will stay fairly mild overnight. And then for tomorrow, I have 88, a steamy day out there with the chance of storms mainly later in the afternoon into the evening hours and Sunday. Once again, some scattered storms, especially for the southern half of the area. Still a very muggy day on Sunday with a high of 86. 80 on Monday, turning less humid there, partly cloudy, and most of next week is actually looking quite nice with temperatures near normal and low humidity. Just a slight chance of a shower or storm on Tuesday afternoon. George snapped a great photograph here, a great sunset near the Stetsonville area recently. Boy, that is a beauty and another uh, nice colorful sky picture taken by Austin. Now, your News 9 Sports.